Welcome. In this video, we're going to cover the company level Microsoft Entra ID summary. So first, you'll need to make sure you're at the company. So you'll select from your company drop down. Then come over to the navigation, go to Active Directory, and then just tap on Microsoft Entra ID summary. Now, to use this navigation here, you do have to have the Microsoft Entra ID integration configured with either CSP or non-CSP authentication. If you do not have the integration set up, you will not be able to view this data. So I'm going to walk you through the data and then I'll take you to the integration and show you how to access that. So the summary ID, you'll tap on the company name. We're inside Acme Core. You'll then tap on the domain name. We've got an OU for, C for the actual OU that's in place on the Entra ID. Once inside, you will get, again, the read-only panels for what's inside that Entra ID environment. So we'll pull through the user accounts. You can see the users here with, with additional details. If you tap on the user's names, you'll get additional information on those users, what plans they've got, what licenses they're using, etc. You'll have the computers that are part of the Entra ID environment. You can see the groups. So again, any of the groups that are part of the environments, if you tap down to the groups, you can again see additional details on what's inside of those groups, what services and statuses are enabled, and any licenses provisioned. We've got licensing information here, what's being consumed by that tenant. So we'll give you the license name, the consumed units, the status of some of the locked out permissions. Logs coming from Active Directory. Again, you can see all the logs grouped here. If you tap into the display names of those logs, we'll give you additional parameter details around what we collected from the logs, where they were pulled from, that kind of information. And then, of course, the roles that are found within the Active Directory or Entra ID environment. Again, if you tap on any of the display names, this is going to give you who's part of those roles within the environment. So you can drill down to see who's part of what. And that's basically your Entra ID summary walkthrough. Just meant to give you a quick dive into the detail tables so you can inspect and understand what's in those environments. As I mentioned, you need to have the integrations configured to have this work. So I want to take you guys here real quick to the settings menu where integrations are found. From here, we're going to scroll down under the Microsoft Entra ID. We've got the two tiles here. One's for CSP, one's for non-CSP. So tap the one you want. From here, you can configure those integration requirements. Once you have this information filled in and saved, you need to make sure you go to company mapping and you map your company from Entra ID over to the company within Connect Secure. So you want to make sure that you have your mappings put in place. And if you need information about the setups for any of our integrations, you'll find the little help icons on here that you can always tap to. This will drive you straight to the user documentation on how to set this specific integration up. We've got a couple videos posted on here on how to set this up along with the, depth, the walkthrough of the docs. So if, and if you ever get stopped or need help on those integrations, of course, contact our support team. We're always happy to help the partners get this stuff squared away. But this is a requirement in order to use the Entra ID summary section.